Oh my gosh, you guys, I have some super, super exciting news. I have been keeping this secret for too long and I am so excited to finally tell you guys. Oh, hey, two things. I quit my job and we're moving. Almost three years ago, Zach and I moved from California to San Juan Island, Washington. It has been amazing living here, but it has also been really, really challenging. It was here that my childhood horse dream was finally realized. I got Kazi here, which is so special to me, and I learned so much about horses. I met some amazing horse people here. So Alex, whom you've seen in many of my videos, I met here on the island at Horseshoe Ranch. Her and I went on some really, really fun trail rides and got to know each other through horses. I met Lori here at Forgotten Horse Ranch and her and I rode almost a thousand miles of trails together in one year. Lori taught me that you could ride in the rain, in the dark, it didn't really matter you could ride and we did and it was so fun and we had so many good experiences together and even little trips that we took with the horses and I'll forever treasure that memory. Jessica, my farrier and also horsemanship instructor, helped me work through a lot of different issues with kamikaze right when I got her. And she was the one who told me that this horse doesn't have a problem, it's you. Maybe it sounds a little bad, but to me I was like, oh thank god because I know that I can work on me and I can fix me, but knowing not very much about horses at all, I couldn't fix kamikaze. So I was really actually relieved to hear that I was the issue <laughs> and she worked with me on those issues and I was able to finally enjoy riding Kazi. And then there's Isla who I rode so many stirrupless bareback rides with her. Her and Lori and I literally laughed our butts off the saddles, literally almost fell off our saddles. We were laughing so hard. I cannot remember a better time riding and just feeling like so blissful and that was really really fun and I couldn't have had those experiences without my friends. We decided to move for multiple reasons. One of those reasons is the island is so expensive. We want to have property one day so we can just look out and see the horses, hopefully more horses than just Kazi. Here on the island, it just didn't seem like it was gonna ever happen for us. And then we have other personal non-horse related reasons why we wanna move, but I will spare you those. Yes, obviously, 100%, we are taking Kazi with us. Unfortunately, because we don't have a trucker trailer, we have to pay somebody to haul kamikaze to our new home. Before we can get Kazi hauled, we have to get her off island to Bellingham and then Equine Express will pick her up there and take her. We actually leave in just two weeks, so I will keep you guys updated with the process of moving a horse and our road trip. To now, you might be wondering, why are you bleeping out where you're going? Well, I thought it would be fun to do like a big reveal when we get there. Feel free to drop your guess of where we're going down in the comments below and I will shout out the people who get it correct once we get there. I am so excited to be sharing this with you guys and even more excited to show you guys where we are going. There will be so many exciting things going on once we get to where we are going. I know I keep using the word exciting and excited, but I'm just really excited. Well, that is the update and that's all that I can share with you right now. But the next three or four Friday videos are gonna be about our move. So make sure you check back on Fridays for the moving process. Also, don't forget to submit your guesses of where we're going below. Before you guys go, I'm gonna give you a hint. Where we're going is in the United States and it's not California. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, give this video a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and I will see you in the next video.